This first term over here is giving us our rate of capital gain and the second term is our current yield. So in this case, because interest rates have gone up, I'm assuming interest rates have risen from 10 to 20%, the new price is a lot lower than our purchase price. The 10% coupon bond is giving me a coupon payment of $100. I must include that. And this first part gives me my rate of capital gain as negative 40.31% plus my current yield of 10%. And overall, my return on the bond is negative 30.31%. You can see in this case, because interest rates went up, they pushed the price of the bond down and thereby caused the returns to not only to just go down, but in fact, the return became negative. Now, the holding period return is becoming negative because of the negative rate of capital gain. Note that the current yield remains constant at 10% regardless of interest rate fluctuations because the current yield is coming from my coupon payment as a percentage of my purchase price.